Hey, what the heck is that? This is how to make a Bristlebot. A simple vibrating robot that goes somewhere out of a toothbrush. So the first thing we need is, of course, the toothbrush. And you can see this. This is the head of a toothbrush. And I've just taken a regular toothbrush and used the clippers to cut off the main handle. And what's left is just the head here with the bristles. This one has some funny rubber things on the side. But the most important thing to notice is that the bristles are all angled sideways. So what you want to do is find a new toothbrush like this that has the angled bristles. <laughs> The funny thing about that is when you press down on it, it's going to try and march a little bit that way. And we're going to exploit that property to make a cool little robot. What else do we need? We need um, some foam tape. We need a pager motor. We need a watch battery. To the pager motor on the back on this one, I've soldered a couple of wires. And if we just hook it up across one of these watch batteries, it'll start to go. The pager motor is a small DC motor with an offset weight on the drive shaft. When the motor spins, this offset weight causes the motor to vibrate like crazy. This is what's used to give the buzzing signal inside a cell phone or a pager. Add a couple of wires to the end. You can touch those wires that hook up to the motor terminals right across the terminals of a watch battery and make the motor spin and vibrate. So that's all we really need to get a little motor going. Next, we're going to add a piece of foam tape to the top of the toothbrush head. 